The Boot is proudly supported by Harvey Norman Darwin. Amart All Sports at the Jape Homemaker Village. And Southern Cross Television. Banks trial in the TIO NTFL Premier League hit a speed bump on Saturday afternoon. Southern Districts beat Banks by 125 points in blistering heat at TIO Stadium. The Bulldogs were in trouble from the outset as Districts posted six unanswered goals in the first quarter. Damien Cubido's impact on the Premier League continued with 11 goals against the demoralised Banks. Will Johnson, the captain of the Banks Football Club. Will, as a player, what's the major differences between playing in Division 1 and making a step up to Premier League? The big difference for us has been the speed of the game. Uh, obviously there's a lot more contests and, and the ball moves far more quickly and with, with a lot more good players in each side, so yeah. probably been the main differences. Elroy Gilligan kicked an outstanding seven goals for Southern Districts who line up against Saints this weekend. Next in the triple header at TI Stadium, the Red Tails face the reigning Premiers. Inaccuracy marred the first quarter for the Red Tails and probably cost the visitors the game. The Tiwi led by 20 points at the first change and extended their lead at the main break. The Red Tails kicked seven more goals than the Bombers in the second half. Tiwi Bombers by 23 points. Roy Cantilla, Simon Mankara kicked three goals each. The Bombers unbeaten so far this season. St Mary's dominated a struggling Nycliffe in the Saturday late game. The Saints slowed a little in the second quarter before kicking away to a percentage boosting 77 point win. Sunday afternoon, the footy festival continued when Darwin and Waratahs kicked off the doubleheader at TIO Stadium. After three turns of football, the Tars led by just eight points against the much improved Buffs. But Darwin faded in the final quarter, leaving the Waratahs to record a 32-point win. Wanderers and the Palmerston Magpies got off to a pretty even start in the final Premier League game of Round 3. At the beginning of the second half, it was clear the Eagles' pace and control of possession would help them fly off with the four points. Wanderers by 22 points, the Eagles will meet the Tiwi Bombers on Saturday afternoon. Nycliffe also struggled against Saints in Division 1. In an entertaining game, Saints kicked only three behinds in the first term, then recovered to lead Nycliffe 28-26 to at the main break. Saints controlled the second half, kicking eight goals to the Tigers' one. Saints have won all three of their Division 1 games, topping the ladder on percentage. Elsewhere in Division 1, big wins for Wat Air and Pints. In Division 2, wins for Jabiru, Pints, Olympic and Mindel Sharks. There's more footy from Southern Cross Television this Thursday night from 7pm on 7 Mate. We will have extended highlights from the Bank Southern Districts game. <laughs>